Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I would like to introduce you to an application called Microsoft Forms. Um, so what are Microsoft Forms? Essentially, it's a Microsoft application, part of your Office 365 Microsoft 365 ecosystem that allows organizations to create simple, intuitive uh, intake forms. All right. If you're familiar with uh, Google Forms or uh, SurveyMonkey, I mean, essentially, Microsoft Forms allows you to do just that. Uh, and uh, the idea behind Microsoft Forms is that uh, it's very simple to use. Um, it's not meant to be used by, you know, extremely sophisticated, you know, questionnaires. Uh, the idea behind Microsoft Forms is that it's very, very intuitive. Essentially, it's an end user tool, all right? Uh, in the past, if you wanted to obtain some information, let's say, uh, create a, an intake form of some sort, we only really had, um, um, you know, a custom list uh, option in SharePoint. Uh, we also had um, a, a, an old kind of survey web part, but that was with classic SharePoint and with modern SharePoint, we really don't use that anymore. So uh, luckily we now have this new tool and to access the tool, uh, all you need to do, uh, you just need to click on the Microsoft 365 app launcher, click on forms, all right. And this is a very simple, very intuitive, easy interface. Uh, just to show you the kind of, you know, uh, the kind of intake forms you can build with it. I built a mileage reimbursement form and, um, you know, that consists of several questions. All right. And let's go ahead and build one together, actually. So again, it's uh, super easy to do. Let's, uh, for example, build um, an onboarding form of some sort, let's say for HR maybe. All right, so new form, we are going to give it a title, a new employee form, all right? And, um, you know, we can provide some description. And, you know, as far as the questions go, we can, uh, you know, we have different options, right, on the types of uh, questions we're asking. For example, let's, uh, the first field will be, let's say, the text field. Uh, let's do, for example, employee name, all right? Perfect. Uh, we can, by the way, make the call, you know, the um, the field required. Um, all right, just like in the normal, I guess, uh, survey. All right. Uh, the next uh, question we are going to add, you know, it's going to be a date field, maybe a start date. All right. Start date. All right. And then uh, the next one will be, let's uh, give it a choice. Um, you know, what I would like to do is um, every time there is a new employee, right, you need to set up a laptop, prepare office, you know, stuff like that. So um, we, I would like to list all the choices and essentially so that the users can, you know, fill them out, essentially a drop down of sorts. So um, let's call this services requested. Perfect. And then this would be all the different uh, options. Let's just say, here we go um perfect and let add another one let's just say uh you know uh employees need a laptop all right um again um you know we can make the um the field required or not uh we can also in our case right we we might as well just allow multiple answers right because uh it could be one it could be all three choices but you get the idea i'm not going to continue with the questions you get the idea you know very very intuitive in terms of building the survey all right and uh now as far as uh, as far as uh, sharing your uh questionnaire uh pretty straightforward to do all you need to do is just click the share button and essentially this would be the dedicated url that you would send out um you know through the email uh and by other means uh, and essentially let me just show you you know what uh it looks like here is our new form you see, here is our new form, all right? And uh, you can essentially, you know, uh, users can essentially fill it out, uh, submit it. Uh, now, as users uh, submit uh, the their responses, they are all captured over here, all right? So right where you build the form, if you click on the responses tab, you, um, you can see all the responses here. Actually, I don't have any because obviously this is a brand new form. Let me go to some other, uh, to some other, 
form I already have. You see, I have six responses. Here they are. And you can also export them to Excel, which is pretty cool. All right. In case if you need to work with data, you can export that to Excel. Now, perhaps the, uh, the another cool feature that I wanted to show you, and, and perhaps my favorite feature, is the ability to integrate the form into a SharePoint site. All right. Obviously, if you have a SharePoint a site, right, you can probably build a link to the form somewhere, but you can also integrate it and make it part of the page. So let me sh show you how to do that. Um, we just need to grab the URL of the uh, of the form. Here we go. Let's edit this page. Perfect. And let's add our form here. There is there is a, a web part, um, you know, that allows us to um, to um, integrate the forms, Microsoft Forms. Here we go. All right. And we have an existing form already. And this is where we pay, paste the uh, URL. And we can actually, um, you know, paste the the form itself to collect responses. We can also uh, show results, all right, if uh, the form had, you know, had already, um, you know, some uh, entries completed, right, uh, you could actually present it uh, to, to everyone else, the results, you could present the results to everyone else. In our case, let's collect the form, let's collect the uh, uh, questions, the information. Here we go, that's it right here. So let me just publish that. And essentially what happens right now is that the form becomes part of the SharePoint page. So uh, if you uh, have your users uh, completing the questions, right? They don't even need to navigate anywhere from your SharePoint you know, page. They can just submit uh, essentially the responses um, uh, you, you know, right from within the SharePoint page. Uh, definitely improves user adoption. All right. Now, there are a lot of other cool features uh, on Microsoft Forums. Probably would be a subject for a next video. But in this one, I just wanted to introduce you to uh, the school and simple application called Microsoft Forums. All right, um, so hopefully you learned something new. As always, happy to see you on my blog, SharePointMaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you very much, and have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.